Hello, my darling friends, Jenny Lee here, and I want to kick off my Money Monday series with a, um, <laughs> a funny little story about one of my favorite songs. It was actually in 1986 by the Bangles, and it was called Manic Monday. So, um, it was a cool little song, but it was about wishing it was Sunday. You know, because uh, who wants to go to work on Monday morning, right? <laughs> um, also, I have a, a friend who always says how happy he is that it's Friday. Again, um, it's very common for people to look forward to having their own time to do what they want to do. And um, every time he says that, I just laugh because I say all the same to me because I do what I want to do when I want to do it. I don't need to wait on a Saturday or Friday or anything like that. If I want to go to the beach on Monday, I go to the beach on Monday. <laughs> but that is uh, leading me into our, our Money Monday reason, and that is the uh, value of real estate investing. And it is something that everyone can do. It just depends on what level you're at and where you need to start and what you want to do. Uh, what your time is as far as what you're capable of investing in time, what your money situation is, what your credit situation is, all, all the above. So um, if you want to have the freedom to say, I'm going to do what I want to do when I want to do it, then real estate investing is going to be a big part of that. Even people who have their own businesses of some sort um, or success in their career uh, invest in real estate because that is where you actually grow money and have money perpetually. And by that I mean, you know, you have uh, income from rentals to hold the property for rent. And um, as property gets older, it increases in value. And so you can refinance your properties and pull that cash out tax-free and invest it in something else or go do something fun or whatever it is you want to do with the money um, because you're going to always have tenants that are going to pay for that mortgage. And you might be saying, oh, yeah, I don't want to deal with tenants. Then don't deal with tenants. <laughs> Hire a property manager. You, you don't have to do that, you know. So... As a matter of fact, there are certain circumstances where I really don't recommend you do that. Um, for example, I have two little trailer parks and um, I've been in real estate, property management, real estate agency, real estate investing, real estate flipping, all that for 24 years. And these trailer parks are a whole different animal. And so, it's my intention to get them in the condition and shape and do the expansion and improvements I want to do, and then I'm going to hire a property manager for those because I don't want to deal with them. I don't. The drama is intense. Matter of fact, I'm even thinking about doing a trailer park story time <laughs> to tell y'all some of these trailer park drama stories because... You can't make this stuff up. I mean, you know, it's 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 crazy. People live different. Um, anyway, uh, if you think you'd like to hear that, let me know. So that's a a series that I think I can do that would be interesting. Anyway, I just wanted to um, give you a little. Uh, pep talk about Monday and if you're in the manic Monday state and wish it was Sunday and wish you could do what you wanted to do when you wanted to do it I suggest you get involved in real estate investing and um, that's that's where the secret lies that's where the opportunity lies so with that I hope you have a fabulous week and I'll see you soon bye bye